the recent spate of armed robberies is totally unacceptable. I will work to ensure the citizens are able to go about their daily duties in the confidence that they are safe. No miscreant will have the space to terrorize citizens and generate a sense of insecurity in our country. The police have the primary responsibility of maintaining peace and keeping law and order in our society and in exceptional cases with the backing of the armed forces. The government is doing and will do whatever it takes to enable the police discharge their duties effectively. We are providing the means for them to modernize their equipment and learn modern methods of policing and their numbers will be rapidly increased to match our growing population and the sophistication and audacity of the criminals. We should not forget that the police need the help and support of the community to be able to do their work. We dare not lose our reputation as a haven of peace and security. I urge you all to join in making sure that there is no hiding place in our midst for those who would disturb our peace. For my part, I will do whatever is necessary within the confines of the Constitution and the laws of the land to ensure the peace of our country. Let us, on this joyful occasion, salute the leadership and the gallant men and women of our security forces, who in the various operations, Calm Life, Kaule, and Vanguard, are putting their lives on the line to protect our environment and guarantee our safety and security. They are patriots indeed.